Welcome back. I am here in the studio with Kasha McDade. We are going to be chatting about the Valley Violets, a very cool organization that I had actually never heard of. So I'm so excited for our viewers to learn all about it. First of all, Kasha, how are you? I'm really well, thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for being here. So tell me, what are the Valley Violets? Valley Violets started um, last month. We had our first event and it was something that I wanted to do for the community really becoming a platform for all the available resources around safety, self-defense, anything geared towards women for us to feel confident in any given situation. That is so amazing. And so it probably, I'm sure there's really a need for it because I'm sure there are so many resources, like you say, out there, but they're maybe not all in one place and easy to find. That's exactly it. So what made me think about putting this together was what would I do in one of those tricky situations? Mm -hmm. How would I find out who to reach out to? Um, firstly, the Eagle County Sheriff's Office, that's number one. Okay. And they are part of our event tonight, actually. So um, Amber and Dina are coming along, just some more questions and answers about what they provide the community, the events that they put on. And they actually did a self-defense class this month. Okay, very cool. So it's nice to have the support of the Eagle County Police Department, and who else do you work with? Yes, absolutely. Um, I definitely have to mention Kim Rock with Fight Like a Girl. She is an inspiration. Such a great organization. Um, gosh, huge support to what we stand for as well. And what I have to say about Kim is that you look at her and you, you think, how did you get through all of these things in your life? You are such a strong person. Mm -hmm. And that's the kind of person that I want to surround myself with as well. Absolutely. Yeah, we all need awesome female role models and inspirational women like that in our Absolutely. lives. Absolutely. Very yes. cool. Yes. So she's actually just opened her dojo in Eagle. And she's teaching self-defense classes. So fight like a girl. Um, if you are interested in learning about all those different techniques, then reach out to her. But otherwise, she will be at our event tonight giving a few uh, tidbits on what to do. I love it. Okay, so tell me a little bit about tonight's event. Yes, yeah, so tonight it's actually at DJ's and Dahlia. Uh, we're starting at 6 o'clock with presentations from 6.30. Okay. And we have an amazing lineup of people. So Diane Andrews, she's with Garfield County Prep. Okay. So they really uh, work with a lot of teenagers and talking about sexual awareness, sexual consent, what, what a healthy relationship actually looks like, oh, okay. and being confident to have those conversations. So important to Absolutely, stuff. yes, oh. it really is. Um, and you know, we've all been there when you feel just out of your elements and you don't know how to approach those conversations. Right. So we're inviting um, the teenage girls in our county, but also their mothers, so they can ha be on the same page. Mm -hmm. um, the, the other people that will be there, we also have the Vail Valley uh, Relationship Institute. So talking more about the therapy elements on who you would talk to and, and what that healthy relationship looks like as well. Okay. Um, the Eagle County Sheriff's Office, like we talked about. Yes. And also Kim Rock, um, she's going to be there. And Damsel in Defense, um, that is a line of self-defense items, anything from $10 to $200, just basically equipping yourself to keep yourself safe. And Megan oh, Wilmers, I, I know, Megan Wilmers was with me last month um, when we were here. And what she said, and it kind of honed it on me, is we, we always have precautionary measures on how we keep ourselves safe. It, it's a seatbelt. It's your fire extinguisher in your house. What are you doing to keep yourself safe if there's an intruder? Mm -hmm. Those kind of things. But the biggest thing that I'm excited about is actually uh, high school students that started We Care Colorado. So their project is about mental health okay. and raising awareness on that portion. So we've got a lot to cover tonight. Wow, such a fantastic event. So how can people attend this? Yes, absolutely. It's a free event. Okay. It's at DJ's and Dahlia, which is in Gypsum, right by Costco. Perfect. So 6 o'clock will start and, and then 6.30 will be presentations and there's food and beverage available there. And um, it's really to have that open conversation. Fantastic. And that is what we like to do. Start those conversations and it's an organic 
um, type of group with Valley Violets, mm -hmm. we yeah. want you to email us and let us know what things you are interested in, what you want to hear about, what you want to learn about. So you're very open. Absolutely. I love it. Well, thank you so much for being here, Kasia, and thank you for doing such important work. Thank We're you. We're really so lucky to have you here in the Valley. Thank you very much. All right, coming up, we have more Good Morning Vale coming your way, so stay tuned.